In a somewhat unprecedented move, the Palestinian Authority is now trying to either remove or expel Israel from the United Nations over the recent passage of the nation-state law. This just after last year's failed attempt to oust Israel from international soccer organization FIFA. And the last time such a motion was brought before the United Nations was in 1974 against apartheid South Africa. South Africa was never fully expelled, but it was suspended for many years. Now, the motion is not even remotely expected to pass, but it would be a profound moment for the Palestinian propaganda. To pass either an expulsion or suspension, the UN would need to pass the Palestinians' motion by a two-thirds majority vote in the General Assembly, as well as get nine votes at the Security Council, including all five permanent members. The permanent members include the United States, Russia, China, Britain, and France, at least one of which would be sure to kill the motion dead in its tracks. But the Muslim and Arab nation-states of the world have a de facto majority in the General Assembly. So while the motion overall wouldn't be enacted, it could still pass in the GA, causing a public scene that would no doubt be viewed as a major victory for pro-Palestinian and BDS groups. It's for this reason alone that despite the near certainty that the motion will fail, the PA will still likely pursue it. According to Israel's Yediot Achonot News, the PA will attempt to use the recently passed nation-state law as proof that Israel is violating Chapter 2, Article 6 of the United Nations Charter. The article states that a member of the UN which has persistently violated the principles contained in the present charter may be expelled from the organization by the General Assembly upon the recommendation of the Security Council. Israeli officials have continued to support the nation-state law, however, as simply a law that ensures the Jewish character of the country. And as for the bid at the UN, Deputy Minister for Diplomacy Michael Oren released a statement reading that, quote, even without the nation-state law, the Palestinians' goal was and remains the same goal, to eradicate Israel from the map, and that this is not what peace looks like. This is what perpetuating the conflict looks like.